Hey guys, Nova Shadow here. Um, this is gonna be kind of a little bit different of a video. I, I don't know. I wanted to talk to you guys about something about today, December thirteenth. Honestly, it's just an ordinary day to most people, but I guess for me it's not. So I guess I'll just cut straight to the to the point. Um, a long time ago, five years ago, I had a lot of troubles, a lot of problems with suicide. I did a lot of stuff. There's one point where, uh, as of today, five years ago, I flayed my arm open four times with, honestly, the knife that's actually just sitting right over there. I'm actually looking at it right now. But, uh, I flayed my arm open four times and I didn't get any help. I laid in my basement and essentially just started bleeding to death. Like I was I was bleeding so much, so so much. And um cuz I wanted to die. Cuz I was going through a lot of stupid shit. Just stupid 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 shit. I was going through problems with my mom, problems with my dad. Uh, just had a bad breakup, very bad breakup. Just, I don't know. I felt worthless, I felt pointless, I felt like I meant nothing to anyone, I felt like no one loved me and everything like that. It, was, it really sucked. It really, really, really sucked. And I don't ever want to feel like that again, ever. I, some, for some reason that night, something told me to get up, to get up. You know, when I live in Minnesota, it's cold here. It's December, it's cold, there's snow everywhere. And the hospital, let's see here. I don't know. It's not necessarily on the other side of town, but it's pretty freaking close to the other side of town. I live on the edge of town. Lived on the edge of town. I'll still live on the edge of town, but yeah, it was about three fourths of the way into town, so it took me an hour to walk there. All I grabbed was a little dinky ass sweatshirt. The entire time, I just kept putting snow on my wound and I drug myself halfway through town just to get help and I got to the hospital and the nurse freaked out and they pulled me into the thing right away and got me all bandaged up, stitched up, everything like that. It wasn't, it wasn't good. You know, and they're in such a hurry, they didn't get a chance to, like, get my name or anything, you know. They just wanted to make sure I was okay. So, yeah, once they walked out to go grab their computer, I sprinted out of the hospital and hid in McDonald's for an hour and then walked home. You know, and, and no one knew. Kelly, Kelly wasn't around. I didn't even know Anthony yet. Kelly wasn't around. He was... At the time, he was living in a different city. It, just, it really sucked. You know, I had no one. I had no one to talk to. I was, I was alone. I was really, really, really alone. And that, that bugs me. The fact that I was so alone. You know, no one, ever, no one deserves to feel that alone had I've had five suicide attempts five 
And as of today, all that was five years ago. It's, it's not worth it. None of it's worth it. I was sick. You know, I, was, I guess I was sick in the head. You know, I didn't think anyone loved me. And, you know, people love me. People love me. Always have. You know? What I'm trying to say is just... If you need help, please go to someone. Go to anyone. Anyone. Just reach out, please. It's worth it. It's... It's not worth just sitting there and bleeding out, you know? No one deserves that, ever. No one ever, ever deserves that. Not you guys, not even me. So, yeah. It's kind of a sappy video, you know, a sad video, I guess, but I mean, it, it happens, it's it's life, it's history, it, it all happened, and it really sucks that it happened, but, you know, I'm all better now, I got Optimus, I actually had to get Optimus, Optimus was legitly, uh, I had no other option, I, well, I did, but I didn't want it, therapy, meds, or a dog. That was that was my choices. So my doctor told me, you can either go back on meds for your depression, you can go to therapy to get these thoughts out of your head, or you can get yourself a dog. I chose to get a dog, and I got Optimus. I will definitely have to. I will definitely have to get some videos of baby Optimus up for you guys because he was he was freaking cute he still is he's my little baby but yeah I just I don't know stay alive guys you know be safe just know that I love you you know I love each and every one of you. We are 123 subscribers strong. That is fucking insane. And what, we're at like 20,500 views? Like what? Holy shit. I never even like dreamed of being that far. That is crazy. You know, and I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm not a YouTuber. I'm not. Wish I was. That'd be fucking awesome. I'd be able to quit my job. <laughs> I would love to quit my job. It's not that bad, but it still fucking sucks. Uh. Um. Hmm. I've been sitting here. Just got off work a couple hours ago. I bought Suicide Squad. I bought myself a new headset. Fucking needed one. We're watching stuff for The Last of Us Part 2. I'm game. I'm down with that. I'm get down with that. Sorry, I was just trying to lighten the mood. But... If you guys ever need help, please just don't... Do not be afraid to go out. Don't, don't be afraid to go out of your way to help someone. It is so worth it. Losing someone... Losing someone's awful. And I don't want to lose any of you guys. I don't even know who half you people are. I don't want to lose you. Not because you're my subscribers. We're family. You subscribe to me, you watch my videos. Pfft, family. We're automatically family. Don't even care. Family. Huge family. Huge ass family. You know, and I mean, if I, you know, end up taking off one day, you know, in this whole YouTube business, I'm gonna do a lot of meetups. Cause that's freaking awesome. That's really awesome. But yeah. Stay safe guys. I'm gonna probably go to bed so I can go to work tomorrow.
and then, you know, game all weekend. Well, my weekend. So, yeah. Be prepared for laughs tomorrow. We're going to have me, Kelly, Anthony, Daniel, Grayson. We're all going to be on GTA tomorrow night. I'm not sure when, but it's going to be a good time. It's going to be really fun. Probably going to get loud as shit. So, be there. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for all your guys' support and just everything you guys do. Okay. So, thank you and yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one. Alright. Bye guys.